Before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. As you guys have seen by the title of today's video, I will be doing a January favourite. Honestly, I don't think I've filmed a favourites video in a good few months, so I wanted to do one because we are in another lockdown again, which is very boring. Who else is finding lockdown boring? Because I sure am. It is just like there's hardly anything to do in the house 24 7, pretty much, apart from like going on a walk or food shopping or something like that, or a trip to begin M. I have been going on a lot of trips to begin M. I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I'm obsessed with being there in the minute. For this month, I have found a lot of new favourites which I absolutely love and will continue using for a very long time. So yeah, without further ado, let's get on the video. Starting off with makeup products, I do have a lot of new ones which I have been obsessed with lately. I did get a few new makeup products for Christmas but my first favourite is the Too Faced the Born This Way Foundation in the shade Snow. I have this foundation for Christmas and I got it luckily um, and it is so good. I would say it's a medium coverage foundation but it's so good and the shade is perfect for my skin tone. The Too Faced I do a large variety of foundation shades which is so good and I think this foundation is probably around £29 but it's so worth it. The packaging is absolutely stunning as you guys can see right here it's so lovely i actually have this foundation on today as well and the coverage is just really good and overall a great foundation if you do have oily skin this is the one to go for definitely speaking of face makeup i do have a doll beauty highlighter i have been wanting to try this highlighter for probably over a year and i finally bought it a few months ago but i never used it um only because i only had a highlighter open but it is in the shade like a diamond and look at how beautiful this is. It does have a mirror in it but I'll just hold it up for now. Look how pretty that highlighter is. I used it for the first time today and immediately I was like, oh my god, this is my new favourite highlighter. Like it's so easy to apply. Pigmentation is so good as well um, and it's only around £15 which is an absolute bargain so I love this highlighter a lot and the packaging is so cute as well. And next up... I have a couple of the Morphe lip liners. These lip liners, oh my god, I am obsessed with lip liners at the minute. I don't know why. I have an addiction to buying them at the minute. But these are in the shade Crush and Frenchie. And I did buy these in the Morphe sale a few months ago. And I've been using them ever since. They were £2 each, half price I think. And they're usually £4. So they are really affordable. These lip liners are pencil ones. And... This one here, Crush, is my absolute favourite. I use this like every day and it's a darky browny kind of one and it's so good for like lining your lips obviously. Super creamy as well and these are some of the best lip liners I have ever used because they're just super creamy, easy to apply, they do not smudge or run on your lips or anything so these are really good and the shades are absolutely beautiful as well. For my final makeup favourite, I do have the classic Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara. It has been out for a good few years now but I think I, just, I think I need to show my appreciation towards this mascara because it is the best mascara out there, I'm not even joking. It's your lashes like super long, it's so black and it is waterproof as well which is what you need in a mascara. If a mascara is not waterproof then do not get it but this one is so good. I love the brush on it as well and it's easy to apply and it never smudges either. I recommend this a lot and it's a great mascara to have in your collection if you do not have it already. Unreal. So next up, I have some like skin items. So firstly, the Bondi Sands Fake Tan in the shade Light to Medium. The Bondi Sands do the best fake tan. You can buy it in B&M for £6.99 and it is so affordable. I think in Boots and Superdrug it's around £10 but if you go to B&M, they literally have loads of fake tans but the Bondi Sands one is so good because it smells of coconut, it does not streak and it lasts for like four days, even longer sometimes and like it hardly has a fake tan smell either which is what you need because I don't know about you but fake tan like smell is absolutely disgusting and it literally fills the whole house of like a fake 
the tan smell. However, this smells of coconut and it smells delicious and it also dries really quickly on the skin which is perfect and it's, it's just overall a beautiful fake tan and I just love it so much so I recommend it if you've never tried a Bondi tan before because it is really good. So then next up I have Neutrogena her moisturiser. I've been using this for probably over a year now and this moisturiser makes your skin so moisturised, like it hydrates your skin, it, it makes your skin look smoother, it's oil free, it moisturiser as well so if you suffer with the most oily skin like me this is so good for calming down like all your oiliness like over active suspicious glands, this is perfect for you and I think this is around £5 in Sainsbury's and this lasts a long time and a little it does go a long way with this moisturiser as well but I've been using this for ages and it is the best moisturiser I've ever tried. I do have a Soap and Glory product because as you know I do love a bit of Soap and Glory. It is the Writerous Butter Body Butter and this smells of like the classic pink Soap and Glory scent which you can't just say is absolutely incredible. It just smells of like pink and just nice stuff. Um, so. I use this after I shave my legs every five days or whenever I shave my legs if I have the effort to do it but this makes your skin so moisturised and then um, like after I shave my legs I, I put this on and my legs feel so smooth and smell so good as well and um, the smell like stays around for ages on your body so I probably use this most nights and it makes your skin so soft um, and the packaging is really cute as well but yeah I love this a lot and if you're in need of a body butter I recommend Soap and Glory oh, like honestly all Soap and Glory products are so good I use the face wash actually and it has cleaned my skin up so much it is the gel one the, the vitamin C um, face wash and if you do have oily or combination skin I recommend that cleanser so much it is so good speaking of body things I do love the Snow Fairy shower gel obviously it is a limited edition item it is part of the lush like Christmas range but this shower gel smells like so sweet if you love Snow Fairy you will love the shower gel because it is so soft and smooth on your skin it smells absolutely dreamy it just smells of like pink and like the butterflies and everything like floral it's so lovely they bring it out every year in the lush stores and every time that they bring it out I'm like oh my god I'm obsessed over it so this shower gel honestly is so good it smells incredible it's pink as well which is a bonus and it's absolutely beautiful I do have a new favourite perfume at the minute um, I got this for Christmas off my grandma and it is the John Paul Scandal A Paris perfume if you guys have not smelled this go to the shops and smell this all the shops aren't open but this is such like a sweet florally scent like it's absolutely beautiful I want to put some on now because I'm obsessed with it and it's like like so sweet and so grown up as well and the packaging is really cute I think they do all sorts of of this perfume I think they do original scandal one the A Paris one which I've got and the by night but this one is by far the best one because it's so sweet I've just like tasted a bit of the perfume and it's a bit like but yeah, it's really nice, this perfume and the packaging is really cute and it has a pair of legs on it, which is kind of nice. <laughs> but yeah, I love it, it's really cute. Another favourite of mine is the Cherry and Vanilla Yankee Candle. I actually bought this in Asda, half price for £6. It is the medium sized, it is 340 grams. If you guys love cherries, you will absolutely fall in love with this. It just smells of like pure cherries and every time I burn this my room just fills up with like a gorgeous cherry scent and honestly I'm obsessed with the smell of it like I have had a few Yankee Candles in the past and they have all smelled absolutely unreal and they last for like years sometimes Um, but this one has a burning time of 40 to 50 hours which I think is quite a lot to be honest I recommend if you're looking for a candle to get this one because it smells beautiful and as to do have 
a huge range of e Yankee candles, so definitely have a look in there. And finally, to complete this favourites video, wouldn't it be a favourites video if there wasn't any cleaner products in here? So firstly, I do have the Palm Violet Spray. This is a room spray. I got this in the cleaning hamper for Christmas off Scott and he knows me so well because I do love Palm Violet and this makes your room smell of Palm Violet sweets. If you love the smell of Palm Violet, you will fall in love with this. It just smells... Oh, it just smells of like violets. Oh, I love it so much. And then I do have a couple of Fabulosa foam carpet sprays. If you guys have never, ever, ever tried these, head over to B&M, buy some, because these make your carpet smell good. All you have to do is spray them on your carpets and that's it. I do have Electrify and Midnight Lotus. This one here smells of the Alien perfume. So, so if you guys have the Alien perfume or like the smell of Alien, you will love this one so much. And Electrify is a bit more black opium a little bit. But it's really nice and I do these in other scents like rhubarb, cherry, lemon, they do them in anything but I spray these on my carpet every week and they make my carpet smell so good and I think that around the one or two pounds I think but so good and lasts a long time as well so I recommend them if you want to have fresh smelling carpets because you will thank me later if you get me. But anyway guys here is the end of my January favourites video. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed. Please make sure to follow my Instagram. It's alice.holmes underscore. I'll put like a, I'll put the name on the screen somewhere and you can all go and follow me and make sure to subscribe to my channel because I'd love to hit 4,000 subscribers by the end of April. So please subscribe if you are a new person who's watching this video because it would honestly mean the world because I think we're at like 3,680 so we're only 320 subscribers away till 4,000 so please subscribe please like this video please leave a comment as well because I really appreciate it and I will see you all in my next video bye everybody